there's only one monkey, one beetle, only one of us can take home the gold, and it's certainly not gonna be you today. Beetle me beetle beetle, sir. Is it you will not win this one today! I will not allow it. Yeah. Because we go, 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 go! Oh! Almost hit me. No! I can win this, I can win this, I can win this! Come on, everybody, come on, come on, come on! Yeah, pretty much in the bag! Yeah, and... Oh, heck yes! Also, hello, everybody, I'm Mr. Jimbo, welcome back to Crying Beetles. You better than I thought you'd be! Here's your prize! I didn't see what the rest of it said. I didn't mean to... get that through with, but... Either way, welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 64. Oh, hang on a second. Either way, hello everybody, and again, welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 64. And so, in the last episode, we did a bunch of stuff and tried that beetle race and failed absolutely miserably. But now, we finally managed to beat the beetle at his own game, and there's also a star. I like how I keep calling them stars every now and then. And, uh, a star I remembered that we needed to get, and we're gonna go ahead and get it. And if I could just say, how you guys doing? It's been going alright for me, doing some decent work, more shiny hunting and all that. Though, if I could just throw a precaution out there, I do deeply apologize if I don't exactly sound amazing right now, because, um, well, aside from the fact that I only got like six hours of sleep, but I think I might be coming down with a bit of a sickness right now, or might, might just be coming down with a bad cold, with a small cold. Don't worry though, this is, it's nothing bad, it's just a little bit of coughing and a bit of a sore throat, so pre be prepared to have my voice cut out at random times, like every now and then. And yes, I know it's annoying, and it's it's especially annoying for me, because I'm the one who has to deal with this. It's just, don't worry, it's just, this is basically the calm before, before the storm. That's basically what it is. But... This is also the first time I am recording footage, recording a Let's Play before I have to go to work. Because today, woke up a little early, but sort of full energy, sort of not full energy. And now, you guys are going to have to bear with me as I remember what I've done and what I haven't done just yet. Because I know I did the igloo stuff with the icy tomatoes, like, hey, you're not my friend anymore because you beat me at a game. That's like no fun. If it's a game, that that's kind of the fun of it. But either way, left. Either way, it was pretty nice. Recently, hung out with some friends, played some Mario Party. It was all an absolutely fun time. You can say Mario Party 4, best Mario Party. Though, one of the only reasons I'm saying that is because that's like the only Mario Party game I played. I mean, we put we played a lot. We played a lot. It was a it was a very very fun time. Though I'm not the biggest fan of Mario Party, but that's like the only one I kind of like. But, again, I've already done this. I'm so, just, just bear with me, I, uh, it hasn't been that, that long since I recorded last time, but it's a bit more confidence boosting to have a, a much stronger computer to, to work with, and I don't have to worry about resetting a having to do segments all over again, unless, of course, I mess up the audio or something. Which, hopefully, it shouldn't. And the, the audio recording for the last couple episodes was beautiful, smooth as butter, if I could just say. Absolutely beautiful. But... Uh, whoa, okay. But I... That's what the earlier cutout was for, is not because I was hacking up along, which... It hasn't happened yet, but it's gonna happen. So I, I apologize. Just bear with me now. If it does, if it gets a little too annoying for me, which it's not yet, if it does, I'm just gonna end the recording prematurely. That way, it doesn't bother bother you guys. But this is like my first recording before I have to go to work, because I'm only I'm only, I'm not scheduled for a full day today for reasons I don't want to don't really want to go into that so yay free time a bit of free time to do some recording before I have to go down to the salt mines okay so now I'm kind of questioning on whether or not I should do this last because this is not the most fun part of the game if I can just say because it, it well you guys will see either way if I could just say I have been 
working on the script, writing the script for the next countdown, I've been like saying every now and then, like, oh, next countdown is going to be this or it's going to be that. I, I think I've decided definitively it's going to be top ten Injustice Two characters. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. Oh yeah, there's. Oh yeah, let's go ahead and get this uh, cast plan out of the way. No, no, get out of the way. Get out of here. Yeah, there we go. Bit of a delay on the music there, but the next, yeah, the next game, the next countdown I'm going to be doing is uh, top ten Injustice Two characters. So I hope you guys look forward to that because I'm definitely looking forward to messing up my lines all over again and making a video that will hopefully entertain you and not make you guys angry in the slightest. Though it probably will. But hey, well, ow, we'll still have a good time, right? All that. Though uh, I am, I have uh, placed. My uh, def some of my definitive characters that I am definitely going to be putting on the list. Been working on their scripts, working on their segments, but I can't finish the whole thing because the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles are not out just yet. So that that's kind of a a thing. But it is the middle. It is the end of January, so they should be coming out relatively soon. And I think, wouldn't it be hilarious if they came out on Valentine's Day and all that? Oh yeah, Valentine's Day is coming up and... Well, I mean, there's a chance I may or may not, but... I'm not going to go into the details, but for those of you who are celebrating Valentine's Day, I hope you guys... Chances are I'm probably not going to record for Val around Valentine's Day, so assuming I you don't see me, hear me in a future episode talk about, oh, like, Valentine's Day, hope you guys... I'll say it now, probably say it again, but I'll say it now. I hope you guys have a safe Valentine's Day with your with your lover or future girlfriend or love interest. Hope you guys have it have a nice day have a nice day. Also also have a nice Valentine's Day to all you parents out there. Also hope you have a nice Valentine's Day. And all that, and just stay stay safe and and enjoy yourselves. And that's really all I have to say about that. Okay, so back into the torturous stuff. Oh god, this one. This one. Th this is another example of a golden banana I could never get as a kid. I could, I just couldn't beat it. I couldn't beat it. Uh, Alright, so... I'm gonna have to worry about the... Eh, golden bananas later. Uh, the, the, the colored banana... Eh, nah, dang it, I, I'm gonna lose this. I'm... Embarrassing, embarrassing myself. But the thing is, you have to kill a crap ton of enemies before, and these barrel Kremlings are placed in the most stupid position possible. And it's uh, 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 there's no uh, okay. You know what? Yeah, there's no way that I'm gonna win this one. So I'm just gonna go ahead and collect these red bananas right here. That's like. This is like has some of the most nonsensical enemy placement in the entire game. And you don't have a whole lot of time to do it because the enemies you have to kill. Alright, fine, I'll get out. Because the enemies you have to kill, you have to have oranges in order to why did I do that again? The door was still open. I can still do that. Uh, uh or I mean that was Hilariously improvised, you uh, you hilarious bastard, you awesome Yojimbo. So two Kremlins, four barrel Kremlins. I don't know what their names are. Ah, no, don't 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 shoot them. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Okay, so walk up as close to the edge as possible. Eh. Come on, hit it. What the heck? I mean, I like how the Mandarin Oranges uh, home in on their targets sometimes, and it's like extremely useful. I'm pretty sure this was the segment where they decided, oh, now we gotta have a home in on the enemies. But there we go! Beat it second try at the very least, so that's nice. <laughs> well, there's the first one, so. Okay. Well, that's the first cutout, so. Again, just bear with me, guys. It, it's being sick. It's not the most fun thing ever. But the thing is, with me, 
when I get sick, it's not, it's not that, it's pretty bad. But I don't get sick very often, so that's sort of a luxury in a sense. But at the same time, I just dread it. It only happens like once a year, basically. Mm. Excuse me, I'm pretty sure there's like plenty of people who like, oh man, I wish I could only get sick for like a week for like once a year. I get sick twice a year, and it sucks. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes, I did eat. It's just been a little while, so I don't know. <sighs> For some reason, this was a mini game that kind of scared me as a kid. I don't. I don't know why. It's very strange. But luckily, this is the last golden banana we need for Chunky Kong here. Just don't step into the spotlights. Bo believe me when I say that. It's like, if you're like a super rock star, that's like the only time you do not want to be spotted in the spotlights. I could just say, I love that music. It's so, so funny. Wait, what? Welcome to bonus stage. And of course it has to be this one. And I think this was another one I couldn't beat as a kid, but I pretty much figured out a formula for this one. I'm gonna go ahead. There we go. For this one, I thought it was annoying as a kid. I mentioned it. I think I mentioned this before. I That also does kind of give me a, an idea for a countdown topic. How about this, guys? How about I do a short countdown of, like, the war of like best to worst minigame in Donkey Kong 64? How about, how about that? I'm just, like, explicitly talking about the barrel minigames, not, like, like the minecart one, the beaver bother, this one. Like, you guys know... Favorite to least favorite, best to worst. How about how about that? If you guys are up for that idea, go ahead and leave in leave your thoughts in the comments below. I would definitely like to see what you think of that idea. Yeah, so let's get out of here. I don't I don't feel like being sniped anytime soon. The only time I want to be snap I want to be a sniper or be sniped is Team Fortress 2 or Overwatch, which I played a little bit of Team Fortress 2. I have not played, though I have not played uh, Overwatch yet. I like Team Fortress 2, I just don't play it a lot. I don't have that much of an urge to play it all the time. Dang it. And as for Overwatch, I definitely do want to play it. It's just I don't have internet. and That's like a, a game where internet is absolutely necessary. Also, where is that... Where's that cast black? All right, so this one, this this one's relative. This one's easy. Shouldn't have anything to worry about. It's just annoying enemies being annoying enemies. Would you? I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna. Wait, what? Is it? Would you stop pulling out the camera? There we go. Oh, that's a neat. That's a neat. That's a nice little trick I just discovered. Will you... This is the time to take a selfie. So I just found out, if you hold down the Z button while in first person mode, you ac it actually slows down your movement. That's... That's... That can be kind of... That can be kind of helpful, honestly. So, let's try something. Yeah, it works for first person mode, too. If I had known that a lot sooner, some of the first person... Some of the first person segments would be a lot less painful. That's actually kind of cool. And that's... I, I didn't even know you could do that. That's... that's Very genius of you, Nintendo and Rareware. Very genius. Here you go. I I would, except... Never mind. I'd be like, here, have a gold star. For genius design for some of the lesser irritating parts. But... Yeah, that's... That is... That... So... Let that be a pro tip for you guys out there who want to play this game. Why did that not work? Oh, I'm using the wrong character. I for <laughs> go ahead and chastise me all you want. I mean, you guys have been you guys have been very patient with me, probably because I sort of know what I'm doing and I know how to do it. But you guys can go ahead and uh, make fun of me all you guys want. Okay, so this one... Oh yeah, this one's not bad. Uh, I think you gotta kill the Kashas. Let's go ahead and do that. 
Why do I find that oddly satisfying killing two enemies in perfect sync? Alright, now for here... Okay, let's see. We've gotta find the barrel. It's not above us. I know this for a fact. Wait, 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 what? what? Where is it? Um, um, Captain K. Rule from... Oh, there it is. I, I, okay, I didn't see that. Come on. I I was not paying. I don't think I was paying attention at all whatsoever. I was just again just trying to be. You know, I'm probably just going to end up uh, making fun of the game grumps a lot less after this because like I know because now I kind of understand what it's like because you have to be in a certain mind place. Mind space and when doing a let's play because you got to entertain the crowd. Like if you uh, think of, uh, if you uh, try to be, if you uh, think of uh, giving up some crap, like you just got, it's just you gotta remember you, you're kind of in a mind space where you gotta entertain everybody, and like that's kind of their whole shtick, basically, is that they do have to entertain people, and that's kind of what the reason for a lot of their stupidity, is they just occasionally space out, space out and uh, screw up all the time and that, that's because that's because they're pretty much in the mindset where they have to entertain people and they're paying more attention to entertaining you guys as opposed to as opposed to super solid fantastic gameplay well that that probably won't but at least at least it'll help help you guys maybe help maybe show you guys what it's like I guess I, I just ignore me do not hit me okay okay let's see for this one I think we gotta yeah we gotta play an instrument it's this level in playing the instruments it's really getting the goat goat simulator oh and I also found out goat simulator is on uh, PS4 I mean, personally, I haven't played it, but that's cool. Or no, I have played Goat Simulator, I just haven't played it on the PS4. But, because I've already played all I need to do, and the humor has kind of died off just a little bit. Come here. Come here. There we go. Nah, I wasn't in sync. Two out of ten. Worst game ever. Worst timing possible. Uh, get in there. There you go. On race to the finish line. Oh, banana! And you only have thirty seconds to do it. I did it. Does that make makes all the difference? Okay, so now I have to think about what did I get? What did I not get? There's like one banana with Donkey Kong. I still need to get, and there's the blueprint for. I want to say Tiny Kong. I could be wrong about that. Let's go ahead and do the quick review. So, yeah, it's for Tiny Kong. I got everything. There's a couple bananas I am missing for all Kongs. But, again, like I said, I'm not going to get every single banana. Color banana. Because, A, I don't know where they all are. And, B, that's just going to take up way more time. Don't want to dedicate a whole episode to searching every nook and cranny for every single colored banana. You know? But, again, I'll get them all if I come across them all, basically. That's that's the whole gist. Okay. Oh, and if I could just bring up, like, as for, uh, like, my shiny hunting endeavors, as you know, I'm, I've sort of become a shiny hunter. I'm not going to stream it because my reactions will be kind of boring because I don't exactly freak out. Oh, there it is! Oh, man, this was amazing! Oh, yes, I finally got it! You'd be like... Oh sweet, I got it. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, that's basically those are basically my reactions to getting shinies. Yeah, sorry if you guys wanted something a little bit better. Okay, so we are definitely 100%ing this level this episode. Okay, that was an absolute lie because I just remembered there's a golden banana in here, and this is kind of a decent. This is this is a pretty cool puzzle. I'm, I'm, I will give it that. Okay, so let me put it over there. 
Okay, you guys are gonna have to just ignore the background noise as usual, you know? It's stupid. Okay. Okay. Because uh, it's just the background noise, I have no control over it. Okay. Let's red. You can go this way. Okay, red. Uh, now, for some reason, I'm thinking of which Kong is not represented. They're all represented in this puzzle. So wait, and there's also an arena challenge we gotta do, and that's like an absolute requirement. All the golden bananas, all the crowns, and all the banana fairies, of course, because you have to collect all the banana fairies in order to get all the golden bananas, which you will guys see later. Okay, I think that, I think the noise stopped for a minute. Uh, either way, we're going to do this do this arena challenge in the next episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care.